What's up, world? Good morning. Let's see what we got here today for you. Oh, we got the geese. Down here. At Woodmere Docks. And the uh, algae bloom is uh, getting a little crazy. Look at all that. We got an amazing sunrise over the water. Dawn's on. Good morning. Dawn, I just saw you texting me. I don't know what it was, but I'll check it in a minute. We got the guys over here on the golf course mowing the lawn, getting it done. But uh, yeah, the seaweed uh, just took over recently. It's out of control. I'm saying that is because of the high nitrogen in the water from all the landscaping, fertilizers, and whatnot, sewage, all that good stuff that we dump in the water. That's crazy. It's all seaweed. That's a lot. All right, all right. Who's getting on? Who's getting on? We got Dawn on here. Who else is getting on? Force of average. Come on, guys. Let's get out of bed. Let's get something going. Burning daylight. Look at this. Look at that. Look at that. All right, we got some people coming on here. Let's get on with the message. Let's get on with the message. So today, I was uh, jumped on my podcast and we did the shuffle. My buddy Mark Zalinoff came on uh, the Make Good Choices podcast. Look it up; it's great stuff. He's also got a great book, Make Good Choices, on Amazon. Shout out to Mark. And uh, he had a guest, Robert Chandler, on, and uh, they were talking about life and whatnot. And uh, first question was, "Who are you?" And there's two sides to that. There's uh, who we are, as in um, we're a product of our environments, we're a product of our friends, we're a product of our family, we're a product of our life experiences um, that molds who we are, um, our beliefs and our ways and thoughts and all that good stuff. We're all molded by everyone that comes into our lives. Um, that said, um, that same angle, um, you know, if we're intentional with the people we put in our lives and surround ourselves with positive people in our lives, inspirational people, motivational people, um, it helps to mold us into something better than we were. Um, so you got that part of it. And the other part of it is um, what do you stand for? Who are you? So what are your beliefs? What are your morals? What are your values? What is your legacy? What are you leaving behind? Um, so it's basically what are you made up of? And what are you putting out in the world? Um, two parts of who are you? So think about that. Think about that. Who are you? What do you stand for? Um, they talk about um, if you don't know what, what you are and what you stand for, um, where do you go from there? Um, we have GPS in our cars, but if we don't know where we're going, uh, we don't know what to plug in and what to aim for. So if we... Um, don't have a purpose, don't have values, don't know who we are, don't know what our mission is, then um, you have nothing to put in your GPS, you have nothing to work towards. And um, it was kind of kind of simple but powerful. Uh, they also talk about, um, Robert talked about simplifying. Uh, we overcomplicate life. We, um, we take simple things and make them hard. Um, you know, the simple tasks, if you, if you look at successful things in life. Why are they successful? Because it's simple. Uh, he talks about Chick-fil-A. Chick-fil-A is an empire. Why? Because they got it down. It's simple. You pull up to the drive through They have someone standing there. They take your order. You pay on the, online. You pull up to the window. Um, you get your food. Um, yeah, Chick-fil-A is good. Is it the best in the world? Probably not. But the process is simple. They simplified it. Um, you know, in life, um, do we stop and look at the little things in life. Or do we overcomplicate it? Are we, are we looking for things, bigger things, and we're not appreciating the things that we have already? Are we not appreciating a simple sunrise? Are we not appreciating blue skies and clouds? Are we not appreciating beautiful water? Are we not appreciating our friends that come ride with us every morning? Um, we're overcomplicating stuff. We're looking for bigger, we're looking for things. We're not appreciating what we already have. We're not grateful. 
Um, so some good messages out there today. Um, keep it simple. Figure out what you stand for. Surround yourself with people that make you stand for what you stand for, uh, that help you to stand for what you stand for. And, uh, and leave your legacy. What do you want the world to remember you for? And it's uh, really a simple, simple idea. Um, the other part of that too, I'll throw some more in a shout out to my girl Jessica Dennehy, um, Pivot and Slay. Uh, Jess has a book also out on Amazon. Um, I was talking to her over the weekend. And uh, she said, you gotta figure out who you are before you can find happiness. You gotta figure out what you stand for before you can um, be happy. And you gotta be happy in your own skin. Um, you can't rely on things to be happy. You can't rely on people to be happy. Um, you gotta know what you stand for. You gotta figure out what you stand for. You gotta figure out what makes you happy and do that. Um, feel that way and wake up that way every morning. So uh, all on the same theme, all on the same theme. Who are you? Figure out who you are and uh, be that person. Plug it in a GPS and get there, get to your destination. So, all right, that's my message today. Uh, of course, we are rocking the shirt. Come ride with me, you get a shirt. Uh, Want to buy a house? Uh, went and looked at a house last night that um, it's a really big one in Malvern that they're talking about selling. So uh, if they decide to sell, uh, I may have a nice big house in Malvern for you coming up. Let's see. Um, great people. Um, so we'll let you know on that one. And uh, what else we got going on? We got some other stuff in the works. Got a bunch of buyers out there. Um, it's uh, a lot going on out in the world. A lot of people looking for houses and not much inventory. So if you're thinking of selling, reach out. Now's the time before everyone goes back to school and get this done. So, all right, let's jump in prayers. We put Joni on the spot yet, did we? Our turn. Our turn. Joni's turn. Joni's turn. We're Joni and Janine today. The ladies' ride. Which prayers am I doing? <laughs> so, whatever you feel like, you go. And then, if you want any other. You go old school. You can go freestyle. Whatever you, whatever <laughs> makes you happy. We'll go old school. So, in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit, um, our Father who art in heaven, heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come. come thy will, will be done, done on earth as it is in heaven. heaven. Give us this day our daily bread. And forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. All right. Dear, dear God, thank you for this beautiful day. Amazing, amazing weather. Um, Help us all appreciate uh, what you give us in life, all the little things that we neglect when we're looking for the big things. Um, help us to find our way, help us to find our purpose, help us to find happiness, and um, help us help to us be better every fish. day. Yeah. Help, so, help the swan find help, the fish. Help the swan garbage. find the fish. <laughs> swan over here is digging through the, uh, digging through all the seaweed, <laughs> trying to find the fish. That's right, we prayed for you, so. <laughs> All right, so with that said, amen. Um, beautiful day ahead of us. Uh, it's my sister in law Jen's birthday today. Shout out to Jen. And uh, we'll go down to Breezy Point later and celebrate with her. Yeah. And we're going to enjoy this weather today. We're going to enjoy the weather today. It's going to be like 80. It's going to be beautiful, beautiful. Hey, Lisa. Yes, I'll say, ho say hi to mom and dad. Who else is on you? Dawn needs that house. We'll let you know, Dawn. Benny's on here. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. All right, world, uh, go out, be someone, figure out who you are, have your purpose, surround yourself with positive people, surround yourself with people that push you to be who you are, figure out who you are and put it in your GPS. All right, everyone, have a great day. Please comment, like, love, helps this message go further. Um, for those of you that are, that are direct messaging me and all that stuff, I really appreciate the feedback. And if there's anything you need in life, reach out to me. I'm happy to help you. We're all on this journey together. All right, everyone, God bless.